First and foremost, I'm a midwife and an activist, and I've been involved in several campaigns over the past year, including repeal of the Eighth Amendment with Dunleary Together for Yes, so women have the right to choose and for bodily autonomy. I recently joined my fellow colleagues at several picket lines all over Dublin, fighting for safe staffing and pay equality during the recent nurses and midwives strike. I was also involved in the fight to ensure our new National Maternity Hospital at Elm Park, St. Vincent's, is public and secular. I have seen firsthand, on a daily basis, the challenges and lack of correct investment in our healthcare service. From our overcrowded hospitals, to our ever-growing waiting lists, to the never-ending weight of patients on trolleys. Our healthcare service is a national disgrace. It needs a complete overhaul. Fine Gael have continued to delay the rolling out of Slauncha Care Plan, which would see public healthcare services reach people on a more effective level at community. I believe areas like Len Cullen and Sandyford will need someone with a healthcare background to help implement these community services. Another area where the, er- where the government has failed, unlike other EU states, is providing enough accessible community creches and affordable childcare facilities. Many families are experiencing a new phenomenon where working people are struggling to pay their rents or mortgages and childcare costs. I have worked with people for profit on campaigns including fighting the housing crisis and climate action. These are amongst the biggest issues of our time. I will continue to fight with people for profit to ensure both public and affordable homes are built across the area and built on public land, which should not be sold off to private speculators. Hi, my name is Ruth O'Connor and I'm the people before profit local elections candidate for Sandyford and Glen Cullen. If elected, I would be a new, young, fresh voice for the council with a wealth of healthcare experience to bring. So I'm asking you for your vote on May 24th. Thank you.